Hi, my name is Sandeep Nath and I'm really excited about life. Excited because I learned from this book how to create options in life. This is Robert Kiyosaki and he talks of the cash flow quadrant in one of his books and how you can choose which quadrant you want to live your life in and how you can get mentored to do so. Let me grab a piece of paper and let me show you what these quadrants are about. Okay, so here's what Kiyosaki says. You can choose to be in the E quadrant as an employee or in the S quadrant as self-employed. But the dividing line is on the left because people in the E and S quadrants get a kind of education which trains them to work for people in the B quadrant. The B quadrant is about business owners who own a system. Now you know, an S quadrant business could well be a small business like a shop. But a B quadrant business is one that has more than 500 people and is operating a system like a franchise of shops, like a network of shops. An I quadrant is an investor. Investors typically invest in systems. So you could choose to uh, be an investor or an employee on the left side or the business owner himself. Now the question is how do you make this choice? 90% people are on the left side because this is what our education trains us to be. But only 10% of the world's m money or wealth is on the left. Whereas on the right are 90% of the world's money or wealth and 10% of the people. Now this is a very unfair kind of equation. But the point is that just because of your education you're here. What if you could connect with somebody over here and get another education? How would it change your consciousness? You know, imagine a room with 90 people in it and 10 mangoes. What kind of environment do you expect there? Competition. What are the values? Chaos. You know, fighting with each other. And that's what we see happening in our world. On the contrary, imagine a room with 10 mangoes and, uh, sorry, 10 people and 90 mangoes. Now, you have an atmosphere of abundance. Now, you've got people who are willing to help each other. And that is what happens on this side. Very often the managers on this side, and that's what managers are trained to do, they work for the leaders on this side. And the leaders network together at forums like the Confederation of Industries, at the Telecom Regulators uh, Forum. You know, those networks work, business owners work together. And the managers compete because that's what fuels their businesses. If you don't want to be part of the person fueling these systems, you can decide to get another education of a system, an educational system. And that is what our mentorship project is all about. It will help you in many ways. For one, Kiyosaki gives the example on the left of a bucket. You are currently creating an active income if you are on the left. Active meaning you show up for work and you get paid for it. You don't show up, you don't get paid. Just like you go to the well, you get water. You don't go to the well, no water. You don't have a bath that day. On the right, in the similar analogy, are pipelines. These are assets. Now the telecom companies create telecom pipelines. The gas companies create gas pipelines. FMCG companies create FMCG pipelines. The point is, while you're carrying buckets, you could start learning how to create assets. Is it important to you to create assets? Why is it important to create assets? The why is the biggest qualification of a B-quadrant person. That's what, in simple words, is a dream. What is your personal dream? Do you have a roadmap to reach your dream? If you're looking for a roadmap, you need a mentor. He has the roadmap. He has been there. There are people you know who have walked on this path for 40 years before they have retired. We can show you people who have walked on this path for 5 years and they have retired. The choice is yours. If you would like to stop carrying buckets five years from now and completely depend on asset-based incomes, there are people who have been there, done that, and we can plug you to them.